Hey y'all, it's your girl Lisa and I am back with another plan with me video or should I say decorate with me? So, <laughs> because that's pretty much what I do. I hardly ever write out my plans. I don't know. I may start doing that. But if you guys would like to see me decorate my planner for the week of February the 10th through the 16th, then just keep watching. All right, you guys. So as you can see, See, I have already prepped and I am ready to decorate. What I will be using this week, as far as washi goes, I will be using this washi from Simply Gilded. I love the shimmy. You see all of the foil. So, you know, I have to have a little shimmy, shimmy, shimmy on every page so this is really cute no it's not bows can you believe it but it's really cute so we'll be using that washi i also have some pictures that i printed on my amazing amazing printer it is a hp mv 5055 printer i absolutely love it i love how it prints off pictures i have this glossy paper um, and I think it's like a 30 pound paper, if I'm not mistaken. So I printed these pictures off. These are pictures that Brian and I took a couple of weeks ago. So we took pictures and uh, videos for a special project that we have coming up. And I'll tell you guys all about that as we get deeper into the decorating with me. So I just picked a couple of those pictures, some that I really like, and I'm going to use them in this week's spread. I will also be pulling from two sticker books, um, probably more than this, but mainly the Happy Memory Keeping sticker book. And then this is the basics, the very first Happy Planner sticker book that ever came out, y'all. I'm taking it back, okay? Taking it back to basics. So I will be pulling from these two sticker books. So let's just to get started. I kind of have an idea of where I want to lay these pictures. So I'm just going to take this beautiful glue stick. It is a planner glue pen that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Love this little glue thing, eh? Little glue stick. And I'm just going to place these pictures all within my spread. And the reason why I chose these pictures in this type of spread for this week is because uh, y'all know Valentine's Day is coming up. And last year at Valentine's Day and the year before that <laughs> at Valentine's Day, I was loving on myself. But this year, God has blessed me, y'all. And I have a boyfriend, okay? She has a boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? Have you guys ever seen that comedy sketch by this lady? I think her name is Angela Johnson. And she was imitating uh, someone or a lady in the nail shop. She did an amazing job. So anytime I say anything about a boyfriend or anything, I refer to that. You have a boyfriend? I thought it was so cute. Oh, where am I going to put this one? I think I'll put this one up there. So I'm just going to put some glue on it. I'm trying to be easy. But y'all know me. Bam. Oh, we cute. Yes. And then what do I want to do with these two? Because they're pretty big. I'm not going to have a lot of space to write. But I want to use... I want to use both of these. Ooh, you're taking up a lot of real estate. Let's see. Do I want to put that over like that? Don't mind if I do. I think that's what I want to do. Come on, somebody. Bam. Ooh, baby, that's a little cricket. Ooh. Slides, they're all right now. Woo, woo, almost terrible, it's almost terrible. And I love this little quote at the bottom here. It says, never give up on your dreams. Okay, so I laid my washi off camera because you guys know I cannot lay washi. So like I showed you before, this is a washi from Simply Gilded. It's just a thin washi with some florals on it. I absolutely love it. And I love how that turned out. I just kind of put washi just a little bit of everywhere. So now I'm going to go in with this Happy Memory Keeping sticker book. And I love this sticker right here that says the best is yet to be. I really love that sticker. So I am going to take it and I think I'm going to put it right here 
And I think what I want to do is white out that line. So, Tombo. Hey, Tombo. Y'all know I love my Tombo. And I'm trying not to touch these images because I think the ink is smearing. So, I don't want to touch that. So, there we go. Line gone. And you know what? I think I'm going to take out this word. I'm going to take out notes too. Uh oh. Oh, Tombo skipping and tripping. You yeah, haven't made a premiere all year long. And on premiere day, you want to act up. Don't act up, Tombo. Get yourself together. Okay, so I kind of. Oh, oh. Well, it looks like that's where we're going. Bam. That is so cute. And do I want to add any else to it? Do I want to add anything else to that? Maybe not. Let's see. Take some of that off. Let's see. Oh, I love that. I love these pictures. So I used a, a local photographer. Her name is Brooke. She used to date my son a while back and uh, my oldest son. And she started out in photography and she's just taken off. Her company is called Distinct Vision. So if you're in this area, if you live in the East Texas area and you need a good young, young eye, young eyed, I don't know if that's the proper way to say that, but a good young photographer, she is amazing. She done a video, she took photos, we had a good time. They turned out so great and the energy was just everything. So Distinct Vision, my girl Brooke Taylor, y'all look up if you're in the area because she could use business. I love when young people are inspired. I love when they are living their dreams and when they are just, you know, go-getters. I love young go-getters because I wish I would have been a young go-getter. If I had started early, if I had started earlier at being a go-getter, then I feel like I would have been further ahead. So I try to help young people who just want more so now what I'm gonna do is go into this very first ever sticker book by the Happy Planner. Like this is the original OG, okay? I'm about to go into the original OG and use these dot stickers to create a checklist because there's really not a lot of space to write here in this planner. So, but you guys know I use multiple planners. So what one planner doesn't get, another one will. This is cute, cute, cute. And I have no idea what we are going to do for our very first Valentine's Day together. So if you guys are dating and have some good Valentine's Day ideas, like Valentine's Day, um, we'll probably end up celebrating on Saturday because we have a long distance relationship. So we don't get to see each other until the weekends. So, um, yeah, if you guys have some good, uh, date ideas for Valentine's Day, then let, let me know. I don't want to do the, you know, same thing, you know, or, you know, the cliche thing, like going out to dinner or whatever. I kind of want to do something different. So let me know what you guys are doing because we talked and I'm a country girl so I like to do activities like fun things and so we were talking about like bike riding and I don't know maybe trying to see if we can find somewhere where we can go and throw axe <laughs> throw axes because there's a place here where you can uh, like throw axes and swords and stuff and you can compete with other couples and to me that sounds like fun so i looked that up and that may be something that we'll do um but i don't know i also was thinking about like uh golfing or riding go-karts like some activity something that's gonna get us out and doing things i also looked up uh, taking a dance class so that might even be more fun because he loves stuff like that brian loves to dance and we well, doesn't love to dance but he just loves to have a good time and act silly so he says he's not the best dancer, but as long as you can two-step, you're doing all right with me. <laughs> and he can definitely do that. So we will see. Out of those things, we should find something interesting and fun to do. I like that. Now I just need some headers. 
Let's see, that may be too bold. I don't know, we may rock with it. That's kind of cute. So everything is gonna be a top priority this week? Everything. <laughs> we making a top priority out of everything. Should I start it over here or in the middle? I need to also keep in mind that both of my boys have girlfriends, Ugh. <laughs> which, you know, I'm not against. They're both, you know, I guess old enough to have little friends that are girls, but my boys are broke. So what they don't know, what these girls don't know is that they have broke boyfriends. And so mama will be the one, I'm pretty sure, purchasing these young ladies something for Valentine's Day. And, you know, I'm just... You know, I'm also sitting here thinking about what I should purchase for these young ladies on behalf of their broke boyfriends. So, yeah. If you're a teen mom, then you trust me, you understand. These kids, they live the best life off of our dime. I tell my kids all the time, y'all living y'all best life and I'm just paying for it. But that's okay. When, when my boys, ooh, when they get old enough, I'm telling you, I'm looking for gifts. I, I need my money back. I'm not playing. I need my money back. I'm looking for gifts. You paying for something. I don't know what, but we'll figure it out. We'll work it out. They paying for something. I'm going to need my money back. I think I'm going to put them on a payment plan. No joke. Here's your bill. Give me something. <laughs> oh, I like that. I really like that. I feel like some of these dots are not. Let's see. Oh, I like that. Now, if I only had like some black flowers, let's see. Hmm. Oh. I don't know. I was expecting for that to be a whole sticker. Mmm, that's fancy. Okay. Let's see. Isn't that precious? And I can still write in there. There. Look at how precious. Let's see. A little leaf down here in the corner. Because we can. Why not? I really like that. All right, so this is how my spread turned out. I absolutely love how it looks. This is the VB pen that I will be using this week along with this spread. I think that is everything. Ah, oh, this is just gorgeous. I love, love, love this swag, the greenery, and then you can see all the greenery in the photos, and the photos are amazing. Like I said before, if you're looking for a local photographer here in East Texas, hit up my girl Brooklyn Taylor from Distinct Vision. Y'all, she did an amazing job. She's really fun to work with. So yeah, also if you guys have some Valentine's Day or Valentine's date suggestions, leave them down in the comment box. I would love to hear what you guys are doing on this upcoming Friday, Saturday, Sunday, however it is that you're celebrating your love on this upcoming week. So yeah, share down below and I'll share with you guys what we end up doing. I also leave a link down below for Brian and Alicia becoming a one Instagram page because you guys want to be following because we will be starting our YouTube channel soon. All right, you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big, big, big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and do not forget to subscribe. And if you already subscribed, hit that notification bell, ding, ding. That way, anytime I post a video, you'll be notified. But most of all, y'all be blessed. Keep planning, keep praying, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.